Uh, we have a treat for the ladies in studio with us is... I'm Dalton Raptoni. I'm 19 years old. Mm -hmm. I'm a vocal coach at the School of Rock. Um, it's an after-school program where kids get to, you know, play in a rock band. That's cool. <laughs> you ready to sing? Yeah. Yeah, we are, we're ready to hear you. All right. In sleep he sang to me In dreams he came The voice which calls to me And he let him sing And yeah, he speaks did. my and name And sing <laughs> Dalton Rabatoni is in the studio with us right now Hello, what is and up? you have perhaps the best audition of the year so far on American Idol. I don't know about that. You do. Harry said, was really? it? Yeah, that's exactly oh, Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. When you were done with the Phantom of the Opera song that you sang for American Idol, did you, you knew you nailed it, right? Well, no. Okay, so here's the thing. They actually cut out a lot of, like, the really awkward stuff that I, that I said. Um, that, like, dance and shoes part was followed by something along the lines of, like, uh, J Lo asked, like, oh, do you dance? And I was like, yeah, I'll dance on the w top 12. Bye. And then I ran out oh. of the room. So they made you look cool. Yeah, they made me look really cool, and I appreciate that. <laughs> That's good for you. So, yeah. Because J Lo called you so cute. Yeah. So that probably no, got you all yeah. flustered. Harry called him pretty. That, ha Harry, uh, <laughs> that happened when I was out of the room, though, so I didn't see that until like last Thursday. Was it cool was, to see that? Oh, it was awesome. Oh. Yeah. That stuff that they said when I wasn't there was way cooler than like. Anything else that I had I had seen on the show, I was yeah. like, they really said that about me, <laughs> right? Like, like, <laughs> like being ca called so cute by J Lo, awesome. Being called pr uh, pretty by Harry Connick Jr., awesome as well. But yeah. hearing Keith Urban say that you're probably going to make it to the top top twelve, yeah. And what freaked me out the most is he said that to the producers, who were like side stage, yeah, not to you, yeah, like that were off camera, and like right. not to me, not to the to the other judges. So I, I was gives like, a little more cred. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So, so but did you wow. sing more than one song? Because I know they can't show everything. Did you sing more than just Phantom of the Opera? No, but I sang more of Phantom of the Opera. They actually cut out um, half of a verse that I did. That's a lot. They well, they showed a lot. Yeah, yeah. They were enjoying it so much. They just let you keep going. I love that yeah. you did that because you walk in the room looking like you're going to sing Green Day or something. Yeah, you know, right. That's, that's your style. Like yeah. you're going to sing some sort of yeah, rock sure. or grunge, and mm -hmm. then you sing Phantom of the Opera. Why did you choose that? Um, well, because I felt like it's kind of hard to show who you are in a competition where you can only do covers. Um, so I try to take songs that are like really, really out of left field and then do them how I would do them. Um, because it's really not about the song, um, how it's done. It's about like the content of the song and the lyrical content right. and the melody. Um, and you know, like Harry Connick said in my audition, it's like you have to kind of see the music for what it is rather than the song that it was made into. Does that make sense? Yeah, they said yeah. you did what you wanted to do with the song, and that's yeah. you. You made it your mm -hmm. own, as they say, a uh, lot right, on that show. Right. Like, yeah. Here's the thing, Dalton. When you said you were a vocal coach for the School of Rock, my ears went what because obviously we have worked with school of rock in the past yes. and we have these talent competitions rock band camp mm -hmm. so immediately i'm like is that the same dalton were you yeah. with us when we had bieber is that that when was you... me yeah okay we yeah were, we were discussing <laughs> like it. no he doesn't look the same is that him no no that was, that was like six years or I, I was like this tall it was a little baby me how, how 13 know, how probably old. probably yeah 12 or 13 justin was like 15 you were yeah. probably 13 mm -hmm. wow. i i learned so much from that audition, yeah, I like because I I went in like incredibly unprepared for the rock camp thing. Yeah, I was like I didn't have a backup song uh, at the time. I was like just starting out. I didn't yeah. know how to harmonize at all, and like it took me a while to like recover from the heartbreak that was not making that audition. <sighs> Sorry about so that. Oh. No, it's cool. You guys made the right personally. choice. I, I voted you for you much. personally. Yeah. Yeah. It was Kelly. I don't remember. <laughs> <laughs> I just remember Rock Camp. That had to be us. It's gotta be it our dog. <laughs> that is so cool. Um, and, and well, I'm sorry. No, it's okay. I, I don't blame you at all. And that's the thing I that happens the same on decision. kids. It's like, especially these judges, you have to break hearts. Mm -hmm. And it's not that they're not talented. It's like, for whatever reason, they're not ready. They need some more I mean, practice mm -hmm. or Honestly, whatever. Sometimes they win, just flat out not, win. not yeah. getting rock camp with us probably catapulted you that's to being the, the, the yeah, artist you are that's today. That's how I try to look at it. Because if we would have accepted you, you would have been like, oh, I'm good enough. I'm just not even going to practice anymore. Yeah, exactly. That probably would have happened. That made you go work harder. That's what it is. Did you go on Twitter when you auditioned? Because I know I, uh, we we were all talking about how you're definitely going to be one of the best contestants this oh, season. Yeah. Did you go on there and see what girls were writing about you? Because it <laughs> like, was incredibly flattering. I, flattering I'm yeah, I got um, well, 
I got like obviously like a surge of of new followers once uh, the episode came out. Um, but was weirder was like the people that like came through the woodwork. Uh huh. Um, like people that we haven't talked to in like in years and years. Like, us. like us. Yeah, yeah, like you guys. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> no, Man, I've been trying to get a hold of you, dog. I don't yeah, know where you were. Um, yeah, my old mom, family, friends, and stuff. exactly. Like um, I, my mom has had like multiple like friends' daughters, and like the friends are people that she hadn't oh, talked to yeah, in years. Yeah, Be like, yeah. hey. I need your son's phone number. Oh my god! Yeah. Right now, and like, she's like, no, 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 I don't think I feel comfortable. It's yeah. weird. Man, yeah. The, yeah. The, the, like girls are super thirsty on Twitter. Like, like the mom's you got your back. Because you're like Dalton Pepperoni or something. That's Facebook. Just... Yeah, okay. I'm. Uh, I'm on Twitter. I'm at Flyaway Dalton. At subtle Flyaway. little plug. Is that where Flyaway. you want people to follow you during your idol ex- journey and experience? Yes. Yeah, that's my personal Twitter. Okay, what was it again? At Fly Away Dalton. Yeah. Fly Away. Is there no underscore anything? Nope. Nope, just all, fly all together. Fly Away Dalton. All yeah. together. Girls are all saying they want to have your baby and stuff. It's going to be weird, man. I don't know about that. I think I'm a little no young. No time for that. Yeah, are, like, your, don't... are your parents excited about this? Yes, they are. Uh, my dad has been with me like every step of the way. He you know, flew out to California with me. Uh, oh, cool. He's actually on the uh, the show um, he's the guy carrying my guitar behind me <laughs> after my audition. He's your the roadie? Yeah. Oh, Dad the roadie. Yeah, Say hi, Dad. Uh, hello. There he is. There you go. Dad the roadie. I thought, yeah. I thought part of the, the fun of being a rock star was carrying your own guitar on your back. Yeah, yeah. but I have tiny arms. Like it, <laughs> I don't do a lot of pull-ups. <laughs> um, who's, who's your favorite uh, American Idol alum? Alum? Uh, probably Jacob Lusk. Who, who was okay. more? Remind yeah. was he Was he one of the... I can't remember. I don't I'm like. That's the thing is he's my he has my favorite performance of all time. He did God Bless the Child. Um, I can't remember what season he's in. I'll have to look it up. But my favorite okay. winner would probably be um, David Cook. He wrote he no that David Archuleta won that year. Yeah, yeah. David Archuleta. So yeah, my favorite alum is probably David. Cook. David, David I love Cook. every song that he's ever done. Actually. So. All right, now, David Archuleta didn't win, did he? I, I, don't, remember. David, I don't remember. Was David, 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 David Archuleta came in Archuleta was the little Mormon kid that sang Crush, which yeah. I love that song, Crush. The one you like was from season 10, Jacob Lust. Yeah? Yeah. Uh, have you seen his version of God Bless the Child? No, we will now oh, that you brought it up. Made me cry the first time I saw it. Hmm. It was um, amazing. Your audition on American Idol's Facebook page has over 5 million views, over 50,000 shares. Does that, it? that basically <laughs> means you're, you've gone viral. Yeah. Does it? I mean, oh technically it does. I don't know the cutoff point for viral. I've, I would classify. Really is there a technical definition? I, I, think, like, I think like a million. million. I think a million. Probably a million. Okay. What, what What do you think your most shared video before this was? Like around. Mm, okay. So you, you were in a band. I was in a band. I've been in multiple bands. I've had you know tons of of different projects. Um, but like the most viewed thing was a video uh, in which I briefly, mind you. Uh, wore a uh, Cinderella costume. Uh, it was called Jesse Disney Dudes. Jesse yeah, he can relate. He's been in Princess Salad. Yeah, I wore a dang oh, dress. It's for very your daughter. It's was, super freeing. He did. I don't. Yeah, I That's don't cool. blame you for that. Have yeah, you done it, it anything nice. else um, horribly <clears throat> embarrassing that you're worried will come out with huge stardom? <laughs> you need to just <laughs> say it happens. now. Yeah. yeah. Uh, not like horribly embarrassing. Like I've had like stuff from like when I was doing music as like a kid. Um, but you know that's like all part yeah, of the, all yeah. part of the process, right? Yeah. But, uh, you're growing. Yeah, it's not like anything like I did that I'm like mortified yeah, that I dark did. Secret. So yeah. yeah, no, and Those you are your, all under my bed. Dance over like, whew, whew. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, do you? Uh, any of your former band members uh, trying to hit you up after you got on TV? No, I mean like uh, just like people that. Congratulate. Yeah, they're just congratulating me and stuff. Good, like that. good. So you're good. not leaving a band behind because they've had that happen before where like the lead singer's yeah. like, I got to go try American Idol. No, Idol. yeah. All of like the beds that I've been in like broke away pretty like, you know, neatly. Like my previous band um, that I'm still kind of in, we're just on like a bit of a hiatus, Fly Away Hero. Uh huh. Uh, you know, we had just released our EP, Lost and Found. Um, and we were like, you know what? Let's just, you know, chill on this for a minute, mm-hmm. uh, kind of contemplate what kind of music we want to do next. And then the Idol audition fit really well into that because we, you know, we we're like, you know, thinking about what we wanted to do musically. And I was like, you know, I'm just going to go ahead and do this right now while we're thinking about that. And 
you know, I made it a lot further than I thought I would. Well, like, David Cook, the, like David Cook has shown or Daughtry, you can you can form your band back yeah. up after you're done with yeah. this. Well, they're yeah. planning a reunion already. I'm, oh, uh, absolutely. Yeah, sure, we already I'm have sure. a tour book. Yeah, I'm sure, yeah. I'm sure. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Dalton, we're going to do a reunion tour. Are you free uh, <laughs> the weekend of April the 10th for my birthday? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, right. Maybe. Dalton, you know, they bring in so many mentors on this show. So if you do make it far, further, who would you love i mean who would just overwhelm you if if you got to have him as a mentor carrie underwood dude oh, you're gonna have to fight absolutely. me for that one i think yeah i'm gonna yeah. have to fight all of the other contestants for that, <laughs> because you love her music and talent or because absolutely. you have a crush on her <laughs> music and talent i think oh. that like I, she's so amazingly talented that i feel like she would have you know, been incredibly successful, even if it weren't for yeah. Idol. Like it, somehow she would have been found. Yeah, I, exactly. All of her music is so great lyrically and musically, and her shows are amazing. And she's such a great personality that, like, even though I don't really do country music, I feel like everyone can learn a, a huge amount from her. Right. Yeah. Just yeah. who she is. Can you give us a hint as to maybe your next song choice? Because I know you can't talk about a lot because you do. Hollywood has already been filmed, right? There's something that's pre-recorded. Yes, we yeah. just don't know if you made it through to the next one or not. But what kind of style or something? You uh, it's it's a throwback to the 70s or the 60s. Okay. Yeah, they make you do yeah. those groups where you have to find your own partners and do the group. Oh, thing, yeah, right? with group rounds. How did that go for you? I, mean, uh, I don't know if I'm allowed to say that I made it there yet. Oh, okay. That's too far. So oh. Yeah, because that's up. not the next round. Yeah. He might have not even made it. Yeah, we're chatting. Oh, we don't know. I see. Yeah, we don't know. Yeah, we, don't, no. we don't know. He might be all free agent. Totally hasn't forever. happened yet. Yeah. <laughs> uh, we're, we're chatting with Dalton Rapatoni from uh, American Idol. Uh, he had one of the greatest auditions so far oh, this season. Shucks. You have the cool. history of Idol, JC. I would say. Uh, I would say in the history because there's Carrie Underwood and stuff. You know. Yeah. I, and and, and I, Kelly Clarkson. Yeah, no, no, you're, you're, no, but you're up there with them. I'm like they're here. I'm like. No, you can't see this on the radio. My <laughs> hand is above my head. <laughs> my other hand is below my waist. And I think what works with you is you got you already got cool style going on. Like Do you it? already have your own style. Yeah, like you got the, the cool shoes, like that jacket you got going on. I wish oh, I could I have try. that. Yeah. Actually, so wear if I, this. If I could borrow it. Oh god. Casey no, would could. would make that fit. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He would take your very that very blazer. I don't think that I don't think that could fit me. He would try. Yeah. Casey's gonna come to work tomorrow wearing that jacket. His hair's gonna be like yours tomorrow. It's gonna be us. Oh, gonna be ugly. I really do wish I could pull off your hairstyle. And it's your a process. It's it's How a pretty long, long process. Uh, it's like thirty minutes every morning. A lot of product. Yeah. yeah. Well, actually, it's a surprisingly small amount of product. Right. I only use uh. Floyd's 99 has this like um, the barber shop. Yeah, they have this powder, uh, and it's like the, the a polymer powder. powder. Yeah, yeah. Oh. yeah. And I put that in and then I spray it. Oh, you do a little straightening now, oh. or what? Yeah, I do. Just straighten it. It's good to go. I'll before JC gets down to Floyd's 99. JC today. <laughs> There's some polymer flower power. I don't know. I'm not there yet. Shampoo. Yeah, yeah. 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 Um, Dalton, you're a you're a vocal coach. at yes. School of Rock. Uh, are you able to turn any singer into a great singer? Do you think? Um, I am able to turn any singer into the best singer that they can be. Oh, like, that's so diplomatic. Like, yes. could you help us each become a better singer? Like, what do we need to, like, what's a vocal uh, exercise we should try to get better? Um, okay, so I think that the best, uh, vocal exercise to warm up your voice, you guys are on the radio, you probably... Really? We don't we don't do. Do. Oh, you should hear We Al need to learn how to morning. harmonize. It's like Flumapalooza. <laughs> our, our warm-up is this, Dalton. <clears throat> <laughs> All right, we're here. Uh, that is actually uh, horrible for your voice. <laughs> See, we're doing it wrong. Uh, yeah. What were you doing earlier that Kelly was giving you a dirty look? Uh, you were going, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> yeah. Oh. What was the uh, what was the uh, anchor man thing that unique? New York. Do you guys do that? New York. No. Yeah. No, you don't. We don't do anything. That's oh why we're asking no, you. No, actually, the morning show is our vocal warm up. <laughs> our, our, yeah, our the first up. two breaks. Our warm up yeah. is walking in the door and getting a cup of coffee. That's our warm up. Yeah. What's well, what, the best thing to do to get rid of snot in your throat? Because Al comes in with a bucket of it every day. Uh, <laughs> oh, man. Mucinex. Mucinex? Yeah. 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 Mucinex. No yeah. dairy, yeah. right? No Al? dairy. No yeah. dairy. Yeah, uh, dairy. I yeah. love dairy. I just bought a, I just bought a cow. <laughs> no, you didn't. <laughs> That's weird. <laughs> All right, so let, let's try a vocal uh, lesson with with Dalton. Okay, what do we need to do? So uh, normally I have a piano, so I'm just going off oh, the cuff. Oh, oh, well, oh my this. god! Is it plugged in? Heck yeah, it's plugged in. I think. Switch some hots. <laughs> and boom. Nope. No. Nope. Nope. Hold on. And boom. Oh, Wait, hold nope. on. <laughs> hold on, Dalton. I got this. You turn the power on. <laughs> I got this. That, now, now, boom. There we go. Okay, so we're going. 
do the Wait, snails with your lips? Yeah, okay, so it's, it's called the, the lip bubble. Oh, what you do is, I'm gonna struggle with you that. You take my mic. Okay, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna do right? Mm. So you have to push a steady flow of air through from your diaphragm. Mm. Very important that you keep good posture throughout all of this. Okay. Through your diaphragm, up through your trachea, and out through your mouth. That's so you're gonna hard. go. Okay. While trying to do the scale. Oh. Yes. And then... Oh, I can't. I can't. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's not fun. How do you do that? I can't even hear the piano. Me <laughs> neither. Am I on the right one? Wow, that's hard. Yeah, yeah. I'm like, yeah, and I you can pretty much it. go all the way up the piano with that's that. That's hard. Oh, it's yeah. It takes a lot of people a little can while. Can we take it a step done. back and do that's something much better, easier? Why yeah. is that helping? That's just helping yeah, get your do? lip control. Okay, so it helps because you are learning to keep a steady flow of air through your diaphragm, uh-huh. so you get more diaphragm Ooh. control, which is how you push out your air in a safe and healthy That'll way. That'll help with my hookah trick. Yeah. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I guess. Yeah, man. I'm Absolutely. The steady flow of air. Yeah. Smoke and, rings, <laughs> Leave it to you want to yeah, you want to work all of your range as well. So that's where you go up the piano and then back down. That is really hard. Yeah, it ta- it takes people a, a little while to get that so down. I don't even know how to use my diaphragm. I don't even know where it is. That's where you have kids. <laughs> it's underneath your lungs. <laughs> is that where I carry the kids? <laughs> that, is that where they go? need a joke oh, about yeah, why about it. Kids had kids. Okay. Oh. It was a birth control joke, JC. <laughs> you guys are horrible. <laughs> I'm going to use that next time I see the girls. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Thanks. Um, Dalton, before we let you go, if, if there's kids out there that want to get into music, because I know American Idol's over. So that avenue is going to be closing up. Okay, yes. What's the best way to go about it? All right, so uh, like we said, I am a vocal coach slash music instructor at the School of Rock. Um, The School of Rock is a great after-school program Mm -hmm. where kids um, learn how to play music in a band-like environment. So what they do is they join, and then we put them in a band, and they start playing music on stage. Because I always yeah. say that one performance is worth a thousand rehearsals, because you learn more there than I you do in rehearsals. I love that rehearsal. so much, because yeah. normally music, when I was growing up, we didn't have this kind of thing. So it was the very like mundane piano right. lesson mm-hmm. with this the is teacher cool. playing yeah. classical. I hate that. It's important, but at the same time, it's like, you got to have fun with it. Yeah, exactly. Rock out, literally. Yeah. Yeah. Dalton, Al and I actually were... Uh, Alumni of the School of Rock. Well, oh yeah? yeah, yeah, yeah. We I took a few lessons. Yeah, yeah. We we, we play played a yet. show trying to stop the boss. You did? Yeah. Remember yeah. we played Beat It? I definitely didn't go. Oh cool. Yeah, we were so oh, bad at that there. <laughs> yeah. That's awesome. Dalton might have been so, there. Uh, yeah, I might have been. Dalton so, was actually headlining the guys. Yeah, that's me. I think Dalton was so, lead guitar. Just, actually. Yeah, <laughs> snobby little kid. We were <laughs> for, <laughs> for anyone um, who's like into pop music, like it's called the School of Rock, but that's not all we do. Yeah, uh, our Dallas school is actually starting a uh, history of pop show. Uh, is it February first? Something like that. Yeah, yeah he's asking during, dad. Dad. Yeah, sorry. Know. During February. Um, so if you want to go, uh, schoolrock dot com. Okay. And uh, check out if there's a school near you, and uh, check out the Dallas school. Yeah. Because uh, I actually uh, work there, and, and also a, the Rockwell school. Well, well, for now. Yeah. Oh my gosh. How, yeah. many gr- how many young girls are gonna yeah. say, "I want to play a musical instrument"? He's gonna have a class full of girls. I want Dalton to be my teacher. Is Dalton yeah. available? <laughs> hey, that's totally fine as long as my schedule permits. There you go. There you go. Yeah. Hi, I'm Scott. I want Dalton to be my teacher. Scott, how old are you? Um, 35. Hey, we actually teach all ages, so that would be fine. Okay. Yeah. (laughs) Bye, Don. Bye, Scott. (laughs) Not weird at all. Why do you have to go there with it? I don't know know why I went there. (laughs) Why Scott specifically? Yeah, Yeah. I thought you were going to say 12. Uh, Yeah, Yeah, exactly. (laughs) That was the thing. uh, 35. (laughs) Shut up. (laughs) Well, keep up with Dalton Rapatoni on American Idol. We don't know what he's up to because he can't tell us. Yep, that's me. And if he makes it to the live shows, which we're already calling it, he will. And if he doesn't, (laughs) he will be on our show every single day proving him wrong. Uh, what's your what's your Twitter handle again? At Flyaway Dalton. Dalton. Same big fans. with Instagram as well. Got same it. ones. Yeah, same one. All right. Well, we're, we're big fans. So if, if you, you make it through, much. we're gonna be voting. Sweet. Hard. Thank you. So yeah. will I.
<laughs> what, Jenna? Like, oh, my God. Between you and Cheyenne Goss. And Don't Cheyenne, yeah. Cheyenne. Do you know Cheyenne? Yeah, I do know Cheyenne. She's so she good. Our, yeah, uh, she's really, really good. Have you guys gotten to spend a lot of time together? Yeah, we have. You know, she's 19. Yeah, no, I'm not yeah, saying it that way. I'm saying oh. because maybe they're both making it farther and farther. Yeah, don't try to. Oh. Oh. Stop trying to get information from me. You're smarter than this me. This is our goal for this season, Dalton. <laughs> you and Cheyenne final. We will see. In love. Yeah, the, uh, oh, you go easy, get Kelly married. Right. You go uh, get married and write yeah. songs about it. Okay. Country Carrie Underwood. All right. We want the yes. hometown visits to be both of you here in our studio. Uh, wait, hey, that could happen. Yes. Yeah. You know what? Yeah. Oh, it will happen. Let's dog. do it. Well, it will happen. Her hometown. Absolutely. I, we'll make it her hometown, too. Yeah, we'll relocate. Your couple name can be Gossaroni. Oh, oh, God. Kelly Raspberry. Okay. I started to be uncomfortable. We'll now. let you go, Don, before we get you married to, to <laughs> Cheyenne. <laughs> okay, good luck. Good luck. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. Thank you. Coming in. Don Raptoni, everybody.